InfoWars.com. It's now being announced as Christians are arrested all over the place for not submitting. Video, Muslim refugees arriving in Europe makes throat-cutting gesture. I mean, you look at the crazed hatred, because these people are real insecure. They hate the West, a lot of them. Now they're really poor, but they're prideful and they feel bad. So all they can do is just go, get it all to me! Ah! And then the left shows up and goes with paramilitary police and goes, yes, here's your card. Here's your welfare. Here, here's your job. We salute you. Vzz, 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 gates going nye, 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 nye. down the sacking of Europe. The globalists are evacuating to armored redoubts right now, preparing the global collapse, preparing for the breakdown of society. We're going to go to Paul Watson here in a moment, but my headpiece just broke. So bring me in another one, please. I just unplugged that one on average on uh, accident. Thank you. But as you can see, I'm particularly crazed today because this is the reality of what's happening. And then I look at all the other news, all the other things that are happening. U.S. demands Greece close airspace to Russian humanitarian aid for Syria when they're only flying them in food. And Russia is doing us a favor trying to keep all the refugees from coming here. And by the way, Al-Qaeda controls two-thirds of the country, roughly. ISIS does. So this is their people now coming in who couldn't beat Assad and couldn't get a couple of the major cities to loot. It's admitted they're from Saudi Arabia, Pakistan, you name it. They're, they're jihad fighters. And so now they're coming in to the West. And it is going to be fun. Welfare cards, everything free uh, in the public schools and colleges, beating up your children. And the police will do nothing. It is a, it is a, it is a gift. It is an absolute gift to be assaulted and attacked if you're in the West uh, by uh, some of these folks. So you will find out how wonderful it is to be a slave. This is the plan. And it's the very same program and plan here as well. Again, 10,000 Chinese women a week come here to the United States to have their babies for free. It's advertised in Chinese newspapers and on TV and CNN. It says what a great opportunity it is and runs specials about how wonderful it is and how we should do it. Really, but the IRS, if you're an American that's Asian or white or Hispanic or black, will take your grandmother's house or will take your house if you get sick and can't pay the taxes or can't pay the local property taxes, they will take it. Where's the compassion for you? Where's the compassion for people that can't pay the five or six tickets they've gotten over the years because they're a single mother? But then the police come and have no refusal weekends or roundup weekends where they come to your house and arrest tens of thousands in each town and take you and fill the jails to suck money out of you. So that's what it comes down to. Then after Paul Watson leaves us, and, and you know, I'm just bucking around like a bull so much today that I just broke this one too. I've never even done this in all my years on air I'm popping the headpiece out of the plug. I need those fixed. Uh, or we just won't go to Watson. How's that sound? Because uh, I'm down and I don't have a headpiece. I, I'm, I'm just so fired up that the cord is wrapped under here and I just broke another one. I mean, I mean that's how that's how hardcore all of this is getting. That's how serious all of this is getting, and it's only going to intensify. They're announcing uh, executive actions uh, to come after our guns. Uh, they are announcing all of these executive actions to come after our families, forced inoculations. We are pathetic. We are not men. We are slaves. We have gotten in this position by submitting to tyranny, by doing what we're told. Uh, Land of the free, home of the brave is just a bunch of slaves who are absolutely committed to any form of enslavement they're ordered to be under. And that's why we've gotten to this point uh, in this civilization, uh, in this society. Then coming up, a Los Angeles plan to reshape the streetscape sets off fears of gridlock. And they go on to say, what we're trying to do is make congestion so bad you'll have to get out of your car, says James O'Sullivan, founder of Fix the City Group, that is planning a lawsuit to stop the plan. But what you are going to do, take two hours or a bus, they haven't given us the options. The city council has approved a far-reaching transportation plan would reshape the cityscape over the next 20 years, adding hundreds of miles of bicycle lanes, bus-only lanes, and pedestrian safety features as part of an effort to nudge drivers, that's a key social conditioning word, out from behind the wheel. 
The major roads are only going to be for Democratic Party own and uh, Rahm Emanuel's brother basically owns Uber. The deals have already been made all over the world where they're going to take existing roads and only let Uber and Google operate on them. So a couple companies will have the franchise with driverless cars. It's all been announced. Uh, and then you will submit to all of it. We're going to Paul Watson in a moment. So this is the draconian plan. This is their operation. And again, space heaters, outdoor stoves, planting a tree, cutting a tree, making a cow pond, uh, building a barn, having your children do chores, having the wrong kind of toilet or light bulbs, the wrong kind of paint. This is the green police. This is Agenda 21 World Treaty to run every facet of your life selectively where you go bankrupt and only the globalists can operate because they have exemptions to all of it. Or they have it built in with their plans and mitigation plans to only have to submit to part of it. So it's on. Single family homes, I told you in the Obama deception six years ago, seven years ago, would be banned in Europe and the U.S. They're already being banned in Europe under zoning. You cannot get a permit. And they're now being banned in Seattle and in San Francisco and other areas because they want to charge you more for less. They will fly above the city in helicopters or in aircraft. You will be a slave. You will have your resources taken. Paul Watson's going to break down what Pat Buchanan calls Islam's conquest of Europe. But Europe already committed suicide having 1.3 children on average. But then the criminals that run Europe, they destabilize the Middle East to now bring these people in and to show you little dead kids that have drowned coming out of Libya. When our government did that, they won't show you the hundreds of thousands killed all over the place from Syria to Libya that, 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 that the globalists helped murder. But they'll show you an individual child and say, it's your job, even though not a single Middle Eastern country will take a single one of these people. Now, before I go to break, I have some very exciting news. I set out at InfoWarsLife.com. I'm going to skip this network break because I've held Watson. I have come out going to the main top manufacturers of organic nutraceuticals to not private label but create our own brand. I tell you what, I'm going to show people what I'm talking about right here of knockout. And Knockout has 10 different ingredients in it known to have you sleep good, to have good REM sleep. And it's just amazing. It's why we call it Knockout. It's got the hops flower extract, lemon balm extract, valerian root extract, calomel flower extract, L-tryptophan, melatonin, gamba, and other key ingredients known because you know, if, you, if you just take melatonin here and there, it'll still work. But if you take it all the time, it doesn't work anymore. You take all this together, amazing sleep, amazing sleep on an airplane, you name it. And your purchase helps fund this operation. Your purchase of Knockout that's been sold out for two, three months, we finally got a whole bunch of it in, helps fund this operation. It has amazing reviews on the site you're not groggy in the morning because it's all natural. It really is amazing. It's a game changer. And your purchase of Knockout at InfoWarsLife.com funds this operation. We have Super Mel Vitality. Uh, we are going to sell out because it's so popular of the Liver Shield today. Then supposedly more comes in in five weeks. We just can't get enough of it because it's made it this top herbology place in Utah that's the top place in the nation and it's just so hard to get the high-quality, non-GMO, truly organic herbs and then concentrate them. And the rest of it, the standards are just so high. So Liver Shield will sell out today. We have uh, the Deep Cleanse will probably sell out this week. We should have more of that in a couple of weeks. So Deep Cleanse and Liver Cleanse, InfoWarsLife.com. I want to thank you all for your support or 888-253-3139. That's 888-253-3139. We have the Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver. We have the Lung Cleanse. We have the Prostagard. All of these are just over-the-top, highest quality, concentrated, super high power. Secret 12 uh, is up at InfoWarsLife.com. Uh, the Super Mel Vitality, Super Female Vitality. Don't forget, 
X2, the best iodine out there. It's all available at InfoWarsLife.com. You can get Oxy Powder discounted with Liver Shield right now, even though it's about to sell out. Uh, but again, Knockout, if you wanted to try it out or already ran out of the bottle you got, is now back in stock. InfoWarsLife.com. You can also go to InfoWarsHealth.com and find the entire line of longevity products discounted. 30% when you sign up for $10 to become a distributor. You can also sign up for auto ship and get free shipping. InfoWarsHealth.com. The Pollen Burst, the best energy drink out there. Uh, super healthy. And, of course, Beyond Tangy Tangerine, Totally Organic 2.0, and hundreds of other products at InfoWarsLife.com. InfoWarsHealth.com. There's also a toll-free number there at InfoWarsHealth.com. So that's what it comes down to. Uh, eight seven, well, you got eight 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 seven eight nine nine two seven seven eight 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 seven eight nine nine two seven seven. Our customer service numbers under that as well. Okay, I'm done ranting about that. Uh, the Hillary for Prison T-shirts are also very very popular. That helps spread the word. So thank you all, Hillary for Prison. Uh, 2016 on the front, on the back, Legalize Freedom. Infowars.com. It's a very handsome election shirt. I personally have already worn it out and gotten a lot of positive comments. I intend to walk around downtown the next few days wearing one and see what folks think about that in some of the trendy areas. And I'm going to ask him if we should put all the gun owners in FEMA camps like we've done already and the majority of them do say it's time for slave camps. We have it on video. Time for slave camps. Uh, so very, very serious situation. Uh, we're doing Facebook mentions right now as well uh, in here. Uh, we're about to go to Paul Joseph Watson, who I appreciate holding. I don't think I've ever been more crazed, more upset, more sure of myself that everything we talked about is now coming true and that we are in the absolute hands of psychopathic criminals that have a death wish towards the West and the engine of freedom and prosperity and true liberalism. I mean, banning father and mother, opening the borders up, saying it's our job to pay for any illegal from anywhere in the world. It is just too evil. While all these countries in the Middle East are taking in zero of the people, and it's Saudi Arabia launching the attacks in Libya and Syria that are bringing in the refugees. The very culprits guilty of it, the radical Islamicists, joke and say, we're doing this to destabilize you two months ago. You can pull that up. ISIS says they're sending 500,000 migrants with sleeper cells. That was in the Associated Press two months ago, and now it's here. And the, and, and the leftists who want voters and divide and conquer and race-based politics are saying we must accept all these people. Paul Joseph Watson's article is on DrudgeReport.com. Paul, thank you for joining us. I know you traveled uh, to Czech Republic where they've halted westbound trains just last week to research this yourself. Investigative journalist Paul Watson, thank you for coming on with us. Hi, Alex. Yeah, Czech Republic was interesting because... They've had the same population for 100 years. They've had the same population of around 10 million since 1910. Now, the standard of living is very high. Prague is a very nice city, but the cost of living is still quite low. And they've basically got very limited immigration. So all the people you see working in the restaurants and the bars, you know, the mini marts, the 7-Elevens, whatever, they're all Czech citizens because they've, they've limited mass immigration but they still have a thriving economy. So it puts to bed this myth that you need mass immigration just to make an economy work because, you know, the housing is quite low. Young people can get on the housing ladder and it's it's a thriving economy and it's got low immigration. So again, it completely puts that on. Just like to bed. Switzerland, just like Australia. Yeah, but now what we're seeing in Germany, and in fact, Angela Merkel came out in a rare moment of truth yesterday Bearing in mind, you know, 800,000 of these, quote, refugees, which we'll talk about in a minute, most of them aren't even refugees, 800,000 into Germany before the end of this year. This morning, they came out and said another 500,000 every single year on top of all their other immigration for a, an undetermined period way off into the future. One so German said, town, the New York Times reported, went from 1,000 to 3,000 people in one week. One picturesque town with 2,000 North Africans squatting in it. Yeah, so Merkel said, quote, what we are experiencing now is something that will occupy and change our country in coming years. 
So, so they're just throwing that. the gauntlet down. You will be dominated. You will be assimilated.